Lane assignments for your championship contenders and one, a 2016 Olympic gold medalist from Athens Bulldog, Kevin Cordes. Lane two, a two-time Pan Am Games gold medalist representing Club Wolverine, Charlie Swanson. Lane three, 2016 world champion and junior world record holder from Race Pace Club, Michael Andrew. Your top qualifier in lane four, 2019 Pan Am Games silver medalist in this event from Athens Bulldog, Nick Fink. Lane five is the Bulgarian national record holder representing the University of Tennessee, Lyubomir Epitropov. Lane six, an All-American for the University of Michigan representing Club Wolverine, Tommy Cope. And seven, a two-time world championship silver medalist from Athens Bulldog, Andrew Wilson. Lane eight, first in the final of this event at the 2020 US Open from the Livermore Aqua Cowboys, Brandon Fisher. Championship final, men's 200 meter breaststroke. Michael Andrew in lane three for race pace. The quick opening 50 at 29 double low. 29.42 for Andrew Wilson in seven, 29.8 from Nick Fink. Josh Perneau was at 29.21 on the first 50 when he set the American record. Michael Andrew, looking long and smooth here through the first 100. Picks up the tempo a little bit coming into the turn and a 102.07 from Andrew. A pair of 33 O's from both Andrew and Fink on that 50. Fink second at 102.93. Andrew Wilson at third now at 103.16. Still Michael Andrew through 150 meters, 34-0 on that 50. Nick Fink at 33-3, able to dig into that lead. 34-0 from Andrew Wilson as well. And now Fink has pulled even with Andrew, edging out in front. And Nick Fink, he's got the tempo here on the final 50 meters. And Petropov in lane five, trying to close in on Michael Andrew. Andrew Wilson there in seven, but the win clearly belongs to Nick Fink, 209.73, as he sweeps the breaststroke events here in Mission Viejo. And at 209.7, that'll put Nick Fink into number 10 in the world standings. He betters his season best of 211.28. Second, 210.85 from a Petropov in lane five. Third at 211 flat, Andrew Wilson, lane seven. And Nick Fink joins us second straight day. You can celebrate a breaststroke victory here, double the distance from the 100 yesterday. What was key for you here in winning the 200? Uh, just kind of staying in my own race, you know, 
everyone has a different strategy and everyone has a different way of doing the 200, you know, kind of not overspending myself in the first 100, not making my move too early or too late. So I think I uh, did that pretty well. I didn't look at the splits, but I think well, I, I raced well. <laughs> I, I know it's hard to see in breaststroke, but that, that really showed me so much patience you had that first 100, especially when Michael took it out fast. Is that kind of part of your strategy as well, just be patient on that one? Yeah, yeah, you, you could call it patience, I guess. I find sometimes if I try to take it out with some of these guys, I just end up spinning my wheels and I got nothing left that last 100. And I feel like that last that last 50 especially is when, you know, you make moves to separate yourself from the pack. So I need, I need a little more juice for that last 50, but that's why I like to, I don't know, keep it really smooth and steady the first 100. Really nice job. Thank you. No spin in the wheels. Staging now for the women's 400 meter freestyle. Pro Swim Series record and U.S. Open record is a 357.94 set in 2018 by Katie Ledecky with Stanford Swim.